गुड मॉर्निंग सर वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग कैन गेट यू रेज्यूम यस सर यस सर वन कैन यू इंट्रोड्यूस योरसेल्फ यस सर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल थैंक यू फॉर गिविंग मी दिस ऑपर्चुनिटी टू इंट्रोड्यूस माय सेल्फ माय नेम इज श्रवण कुमार आई एम फ्रॉम निर्मल बट करंटली स्टेइंग इन हैदराबाद आई हैव कंप्लीटेड माय बैचलर्स डिग्री इन संस्कृति कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग टेक्नोलॉजी विद सिविल ब्रांच एट गक्के सर अलॉन्ग विद माय डिग्री आई हैव ऑल्सो कंप्लीटेड माय डॉट नेट एंड एसकेएल कोर्सेस आई बिलोंग टू न्यूक्लियर फैमिली माय स्ट्रेंथ्स आर एम सेल्फ मोटिवेटेड एंड हार्ड वर्किंग एंड ऑनेस्ट पर्सन माय शॉर्ट टर्म गोल इज टू गेट ए जॉब इन रिप्टेड कंपनी एंड माय लॉन्ग टर्म गोल इज टू अचीव ए गुड पोजिशन वेर इट कैन बिल्ड माय करियर एंड हेल्प द ऑर्गनाइजेशन टू माय हॉबीज आर प्लेइंग गेम्स लाइक चेस वॉलीबॉल बैडमिंटन एंड रीडिंग बुक्स लिजनिंग म्यूजिक एंड कुकिंग एंड दैट्स ऑल अबाउट मी थैंक यू सर नो कमिंग टू टेक्निकल वॉट इज सी शार C Sharp is a object-oriented programming language which is developed by Microsoft in the year of 2000. Uh, it is widely used to develop several kinds of applications like desktop applications, web applications, gaming applications and mobile applications. Now what is object-oriented programming structure? Okay, object or uh, object-oriented program uh, structure is used uh, mainly used for reusability of the code which provides security to our application. Uh, it makes simpler to build the applications. Okay the concepts of oops are classes objects abstraction encapsulation polymorphism and inheritance okay so what is uh, inheritance uh, inheritance is creating a relationship between the parent class and the child class uh, the main use of inheritance is reusability okay uh, now what is polymorphism polymorphism means uh, poly means many and morphism is behavior when we give different kinds of input it shows different kinds of behaviors based on the input changes uh like what is uh, encapsulation 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 means uh, binding or grouping the members of the class uh, and uh, members of the functions uh, together okay. and uh, creating an object to the uh, class is mandate okay what is abstraction then abstraction is uh, hiding the implementation data and uh, providing the service to the uh, service to the end user okay. so uh, what are function overloading and overriding concepts uh function overloading is uh, implementing uh, implementation of the same function uh, function names and uh, same signature Where, uh, whereas uh, function overriding is uh, implementation of the same function name and uh, same sig- uh, signature okay. now uh, coming to uh, like what exactly uh, sql server sql server sql stands for uh, Uh, structure query language uh, which is mainly used for uh, uh, accessing and manipulating the data from the database okay. uh, what are the different types of uh, like we have different types under the database like in case if you are uh, making changes we call it as dml so what are the things which we have apart from dml uh, apart from dml we have uh, ddl data definition language dml data manipulation language and another one is data control language and uh, transaction control language what is data manipulation language uh, data manipulation language is used for uh, manipulating the data which is present in the database it contains uh, uh, such kind of comments like select update delete and insert okay what is uh, data definition language ddl data definition language okay data definition language is used to uh, creating tables in the Uh, database uh, and it contains a create alter delete uh, truncate okay what is uh, uh, tcl then tcl uh, tcl stands for uh, transaction control language it is mainly used when uh, uh, when we do transactions at the time it contains a commit and uh, rollbacks and save okay so Uh, now coming to asp.net what is asp.net asp.net stands for uh, active web server page uh, which is a software technology used to build several kinds of web applications okay so what are the t- different types of uh, like when you are going to develop an application using asp.net what are the things which will be mostly implemented like controls what are the ma- mo- major important controls uh, um, when we are going to build a web applications so there are some kind of applic- uh, controls like uh, validation controls data bound controls and uh, state management techniques are mainly uh, used in building the web applications yes what is state management then uh, 
if you want to maintain the state of control from one page to another page uh, or within the page at that time we go for the state management techniques uh, state management techniques are of two types server side and client side server side uh, contains uh, session state and application state whereas client side contains um, view state query string uh, hidden fields etc yes now uh, what are validation controls why we use them uh validation controls are used for uh, providing information to the uh, client client at the time of uh, web uh, usage uh, there are five kinds of uh, validation controls uh, in asp.net they are uh, regular field validator regular expression validator compare validator range validator and summary validator okay. now uh, what is uh, when you are coming to data in your document what are the main important things will be writing in order to establish database relation in database relation uh, in, if you want to maintain the relation between a front end and client, uh, server side data side uh, we mainly yeah, connection can, classes yes. um, by using sql connection uh, we can give uh, connection to the uh, database yeah, what is the other classes we have other classes like um, data set yes sql command sql command sql command and data set yes so what is the uh, like uh, when you are what are data grid controls data grid controls are used to uh, provide the uh, to display the data to the end user in the web page, web application in required manner uh, it provides the data in a grid view yes so what are client side technologies we have client side technologies are uh, html css javascript and uh, bootstrap sir okay so what is the uh, html html is a hypertext markup language okay so why we use them uh, html is used to uh, uh, display the text on the web page do you have any questions no sir uh, about my mock interview rating yeah it is it is nice and uh, you are good at uh, technical so it was nice talking to you okay